kicking it with the coaches this week at Holtville High School. A huge game coming up this weekend for Holtville. Head coach Jason Franklin joins us. Coach, how are you today? I'm doing well. Good, good to have you here. So you guys got a big one in Demopolis. Tell me about the season so far. You guys started off 6-1 and one in great shape. What do you like about the team so far? Well, this team has been a, a group that has really just got along, and they come every day and they practice hard. And, uh, you know, when you, when you keep the distractions away, and we've been really healthy so far, so those factors have played into where we are right now. You've been here since 2017. What is your imprint on this team? What do you hope the guys bring to the table every day at practice and, of course, Friday night to the game? Well, you know, our motto has been kind of no words. Just go out and let your, uh, your actions on the field speak for itself. And, uh, and they have. They've been a really, you know, a group that goes out and just plays hard. And uh, we're not the most talented team in the state, but I think what we do is we play really hard. We do what we're supposed to do, and uh, they really like each other. That's the big thing. They get along. They get along at practice, get along in the locker room, and we don't have a whole lot of distractions. You guys got a big road trip, about two hours to Demopolis. Both teams undefeated in region. Talk about practice during the week. Is it any different when you have a big game, or are things just kind of the same? I told our guys, you know, I put the pressure on them every week. Um, so by this time of the season, they're battle tested, and they, they understand what it takes to, to go over there Friday night and play well. And I mean, in any game, you're going to need some things to go your way. Um, so, you know, I told them just to expect some adversity and uh, we've prepared them and uh, I feel confident they'll be ready to go. Anything different schedule wise when you got to do a road trip like this is a pretty good journey over there. Well we'll leave a little earlier um, you know we'll do things differently you know if we're at home we do a certain kind of regiment but when we're on the road we do a totally different thing and uh, we'll feed them when they get on the bus to, to, to leave Friday and then we'll do pregame uh, in Demopolis and uh, then we'll just take a little short trip over to the school and uh, get prepped to go. One of these games could definitely affect playoff seedings. What's it going to take for Hopeville to win this game? We're going to have to limit the penalties. We're going to have to make sure we take care of the football, and uh, we're going to need some. Uh, we're going, you know, like we've talked this week. I think we need something good to happen in the special teams game. When you get to this point in the season, we're well past the midway point. What are some things you look for your team to do? I realize it's been a long season. You guys are in great shape now. What do you want to see as you come down the home stretch? You know, just keep consistency. You know, we need to be able to run the football. We got to be able to throw it when we need to. Uh, play sound defense, and uh, if you do those things and, and, and limit the mistakes in the special teams area, you're going to be in good shape any Friday night. Coach, safe travels to Demopolis. Wish you the Thank best you of man. luck, and uh, we'll see you Friday night on the Fever, those highlights right. as well. Thank, Thank you again you. for Coach for joining us, and that will do it for this week's edition of Kicking It with the Coaches.